what is up my cranky crew? It's Ethan from Crank Gameplay and today We're back in more of Mr. Masaji. This is really fucking loud. <laughs> anyway, we're back in more of Mr. Masaji. I have not played this game in a really long time, and I don't know why. Because the first video, you guys absolutely loved it, and I loved it, and I don't know why I didn't play it again. Like that was months ago that I played it. So I'm playing it again because it's a really fun game, and it's really funny. So We've got Dorothy here, 31. Let's go with you. Not enough experience. God damn. Well, we don't have enough experience for like hardly any of these people. Like at all. We can do Rial, but I think we already did that. We already did Nicole. Martha. I don't, I don't think we've done Martha. Did we do Martha? I don't think so. So I'll come back to you in a second. We definitely didn't do Martha. So let's do that. Wait, change your profile. Why do I have to change my profile? Oh, I have to select a new one. Let's do this. How sexy am I? All right, let's do that. So we'll go back. We'll go back to Martha right here. We'll do you. It's a match. You and Martha like each other. Of course we like each other. Why wouldn't she like this sexy hunk of man right about here? Keep regular eye contact. It's a powerful way to remind her date that you have sight. Hmm. Perfect. Johnny is having an online date with Martha. Is that Martha? Hi, Martha. You look very different from your picture. Welcome. You are online. O okay. Hi. Uh, let's do, let's do sup. Let's do good. Huh. Sup. Hey. Sad dit. Hi. <laughs> Martha. So, right. Hey, you have a cute nose. I know. Look at this. Oh, you could just boop it all day long, couldn't you? Nice plates you have there. Thank you, you have a cute, actually, you're not cute at all. Hey, wait a minute, you look a lot of things. Yeah, you don't look a lot like your profile pic. Don't be silly, that their profile picture is a drawing, not a photograph. Can't you tell the difference between reality and fiction? You got me there, Martha, you got me there. But that is a cartoon of me when I was, uh, uh, when I was but 19, when I worked as a lingerie model. Oh, really? Oh, Mr. Massage, okay. They commissioned that picture from their famous French guy, but I got lost in Paris shortly after. Oh, look at the massages on my neck. So, hey, put that drawing on the right mil on the milk cartons and in the paper. Oh, man, that was a weird couple of days. They made me travel all around the world, you know? You wouldn't, uh, you wouldn't know it by looking at me now, snort. <laughs> anyway. Wow, that sounds like an old truck driver story. Wow, that's amazing. You aged like five wine. You aged like fine wine. That sounds like a lot of BS to me. Let's do, that's amazing. You aged like fine wine. Yes, you're gorgeous. Ooh la la, you're as charming as freshly baked baguette. Huh. Wee wee, my Madame, I believe I have a couple of stories from my modeling days for you. Okay, tell them to me. After being in Paris, I was called for a hamburger modeling photo session. I was with my boyfriend at the time. So I changed into a red bikini and I had to sit in this sticky black couch. Then this hunky guy comes in and gives me the oh, burger. Quality. What? What is that noise? I'm all hunched over because I got the controller on my neck, by the way. I don't I don't have a hunchback. What I found is creepy that they were filming the whole thing. I'm like, wait up, what's going on here? So it was a porn thing. Ah, never trust a burger ad, guys. They're always trying to fuck you. Then they started asking me some funky <laughs> stuff, right? Turns out they were filming an independent movie and I was in the wrong room. Ha <laughs> ha! Was it ever lucky that my ex is around? My, my ex was around. He saw the couch and said we had to leave. Can't think what got into him. Yeah, but he's never seen that couch before ever. Never ever has any dude seen a couch like that. Never ever. I definitely haven't. I've never watched porn in my life. Your ex might not have been completely honest with you. Well, I have a black couch in my place. We can eat burgers there if you want. So what was the name of that independent movie? Let's do that one. I'm a little bit silly. Ha <laughs> ha, a, a good goof for you. Ha <laughs> ha, hamburgers aren't my thing, don't you know? But I can make an exception just for you, honey waffle. Oh, thanks. I believe we can hang out for a while and laugh a lot. Pick up, pick you up in my truck. Ironically enough, I'm transporting couches and grills today. Oh, isn't that just a tiffy? And I could just just be there in a black couch somewhere at the day just sitting that dread blue bow. Johnny is ready to eat some fine mighty burgers. Best day ever. Look. All right, is this the massagerino? Let me put my finger in your mouth. Don't look at me. Oh, 
The fuck did I do that? What am I doing? I've got to cover myself. All right, we're done with this date. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, what do we do now? I don't know. Mama's Jellio, slow and intense. The massage for real men. Oh, yeah. All right, well, that was some good stuff. So let's go to the next person. 15, I don't have enough for you, uh, so can't do that. I do have enough for Mayo, though. That's nice. Oh, wait, I have to change my profile. Okay, so I'm gonna change to uh, the big that dude. So we'll do that, okay? And you, nope, okay. What do you like in a man? What do you like in a man? A man that can really stick his hand right by your ear and just whisper right into you, whisper sweet nothings into your ear. Is that what you like? You guys see all the chest hair that I have? Yeah, it's pretty manly, right? I know. Oh, hi, my name is Mayo. Welcome to my apartment. Make yourself at home. This is the same Mayo uh, people that made that Mayo game. Uh, I actually haven't played it, but I've seen it a lot. Maybe I'll play that in the future. It's like a clicker game. But anyway, make yourself at home. I have a chair somewhere. At least I think I do. Sigh. Uh, what? What the f Fuck? Let's go with fuck. Yeah, yeah, I know. My apartment is an armpit. So messy. Oh, hey, may I offer you something to drink? No, when I said fuck, I meant like fuck. It's time for me to fuck a jar of mayo. Anyway, ah, uh, thanks, I'm not thirsty. Anything will do, I'm unusually thirsty. That's me, unusual thirst. Okay, here you go. Mayo gave Johnny a glass of with white substance and some mint leaves. Oh, I know, I look a bit down. Sorry I can't be a better host at the moment. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it, Mayo, you're doing great. I was so incredibly lucky that you picked me and Linger. You must have a nice butt. You know it, babe. Look at this ass. Look at it. Look at my butt. It's so great. Wow, we. I've gotta stop. I've gotta stop. I can't. Why? Maybe you don't want to hear about it. Really, no one should. Oh, well, hell no. I mean, yeah, okay, no, bye. <laughs> sure, I will. I'm a great listener. I'm the best listener in the world. Everybody knows that about me. Oh, you will? Well, here it goes. It's just that I feel like my father is not proud of me, you know? I'll be proud of you. You're so delicious. That makes me seriously lose my confidence. So a few days ago, this girl I had left me, it was really stupid, really. So I kind of put my own sexuality into question. I'm just confused now. I don't know what I want or who I am anymore. You're mayo. That's just it. You're your jar of mayo, you know? What's wrong with your dad? You seem like a tasteful person. Haha, <laughs> puns. Oh, I've had terrible dates as well. Tell me about yours. Let me help you. Let's talk. start by talking about your feelings. Let's go with a tasteful person. Well, it all started when I was a young boy. I just really wanted to play my guitar, catch my drift, to be a rock star. Oh, I know all about that rock and roll. Like a metal zombie rock star? Like a hardcore metal rock star? Like that famous classical composer Wolfgang Ahmed Mabs must... Yep, that one. Like, uh, let's go with a hardcore metal rock star. Well, no, like a glam rock star. <laughs> oh, did you see the mayo blush? That was so cute. Anyways, as a kid, I had this big fight with my dad. He wanted me to just, to be just like him. He was so ordinary at the time and I was just starting to grow, see? I eventually got really depressed and lost my way. I had a dark phase, like other kids. I was a dark, discolored emo kid. I'm ashamed to say. Ha, what a loser! Nah, not a loser at all. Let's <laughs> smile. <laughs> a silent fart. Let's do that. It kind of smells like shrimp, but I don't really remember putting up an air freshener. Hey, you are a great listener, aren't I? I'm the best listener. Thank you for hearing me out. But yeah, I didn't have a great relationship with my father. Man, I never knew my dad. Reminds me, I was bullied for being skinny. Women hate me, and I see my mother in every girl I've dated. Let's go with, it reminds me, I was bullied for being skinny. Let's go with that, because a bunch of people throughout my life have always been like, you need to eat more, you're so skinny, blah, 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 blah. Sorry. So anyway, after all these years and some strong medications, my dad now supports me, but it feels as if he doesn't mean it. So now I'm gonna study and become a mime. I love being unique. It makes me feel like a special snowflake, you know? But I always feel like, like I still need my father's approval. Pathetic, isn't it? Um, no. A mime? That's awesome. Yeah, you're great. <laughs> Thank you. I think I get it. I don't need my uh, the approval of my father. No, you don't. As long as you approve of yourself, you're a great person. Yeah. All I need was a good friend. And hey, Johnny, you know what? I feel like going wild. Like. We've known each other for a while. I've been alone with you. Inside my jar. And 
in my dreams. I've kissed your lid a thousand times. Sometimes I see you pass inside my door. Hello? Is it me you're looking for? There's no saxophone at this part. <laughs> I can see it in your pecs. I can see it in your smile. Thanks for noticing my sweet pecs. You're all I've ever wanted. My pecs are wide open. See? Don't look at these. Stop! Cause you know just what to say. You know just what to do. And I want to tell you so much. I love you. Kiss me. Kiss me like you never have before, Mayo. Damn, Johnny, he just opened Mayo to himself. <laughs> I don't know what this happened. I just came out of a fever dream. I remember nothing and everything at the same time. Why is my bottom shirt off? What have I done? Anyway, here's the massage part. All right, it's good enough for me. Well, let's go to another one. We don't have, we only have 14 of these. What if we have to replay someone? That would kind of suck, wouldn't it? Yeah, see, we don't have enough. We don't have enough. All right, here we go. I've got the power now. So I've got 17 things. Wait, let's go back. Let's go to Sarah. She seems like a fucking babe. And we've got the same goddamn hair! We're destined to be together, shit! We gotta change our profile. What is Sarah like? A big muscular man-man? Johnny is in the wacko lounge. Sarah is right next to him. Hi, Sarah. You look really cute. What the hell do you want? Hey, I'm Johnny, the guy you matched in Linger to lose my virginity. You are beautiful and pretty and I really want to date you. Yeah! You know what? Fuck off. I'm not crying. Let's try again. Let's be a little bit more abrupt, I guess. Hey, I'm Johnny, the guy you matched with on Linger. What? Really? I don't remember doing that. But you know what? There's something in your face that makes me just want to punch you. What the fuck could that be, Sarah? What are you talking about? Heck, why not? I'll stick around for a while. Man, this place is getting boring as fuck or what? That's because we're not dancing. Hey, want to play a game? Knock, knock. How about I get you a mojito? It's on me. You like mojitos, don't you? No, duh. Of course it's going to be on you. What are you waiting for? A cookie? Just go. Johnny quietly bought a tasty mojito for Sarah. Damn, that's good. This place has the best mojitos. Good call. I forgot your name, but don't you dare think my panties are going off now. You get one chance, so what do you do for fun? I have or help orphan puppies, unprotected sex, drugs, and rock and roll. That's me! What, you thought this fucking blueberry was, uh, cute and cuddly and real precious and liked helping orphan puppies? No! I like unprotected sex! <sighs> oh, I'm just digging myself into a hole with this video. Digging myself into a hole. Ooh, what a badass. Are you actually trying to impress me? Do you even know any good positions? Uh, yeah, the slippery avocado. You're kinky, not bad for a virgin. How do you know that I'm a virgin? You don't know anything about me, Sarah. You know what? You're kind of burly. How big are you? Uh, 6.9 feet tall. Depends on the temperature. How big do you want me to be? 6.69. It's not tall I am. 6'9"? You're trying too hard. The mojito wore off. This is getting boring. Yeah, um, I'll be right back. Or whatever. Sarah went to the bar. She's talking with a stranger. Sarah's still at the bar. Johnny's dancing the crap out of the dance floor. You know I am! Johnny just won a prize for an exotic move. He won $500! She came back! I sent a gold digger! Well, hey, I heard some money over here. I mean, nice to see you again, dude. So what you gonna do with all that money? I don't know. What do you want to do? Let's go with that, because I think I'm playing the game right now, guys. I know how to play the game of love. <laughs> Gee, I don't know. I would have a midnight great night. <laughs> I mean, the amount of money that could be spent super easily. <laughs> oh man, this one time I was so a wasted. I actually spent like five hundred dollar on a tattoo. Me too. I've got tats everywhere, and not the one I have on the arm. This one's somewhere else. 
Maybe you can find out. <laughs> Who, me? You talking about me? Can I see it? <laughs> Fuck, dude. Ha <laughs> ha! Keep it in your pants for now. I'm not an easy broad. Keep me interested and you just might see it. Gee whiz, my mom would let me never spend my time. Nah, nah. Hey, this totally reminds me of something hilarious. Knock, knock. <laughs> well, who's there? Add statistics. Let's do that. As a what? <laughs> never mind, I forgot the joke. Let's do that. She's impressed. <laughs> You're so funny. Hey, I totally want to get to know you better. What do you do for a living? I sell hot dogs. I consider myself a gentleman. Ladies first. My music makes my <gasps> nipples twist. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Sorry about that out loud. Were you asking about my vast fortune? <laughs> right, fortune. N nah, nothing like that at all. You're just so interesting. I want to know more. I just want to ask you about your hobbies. I see some muscle on you aside from brains. Like, you do sports? Yeah. I play lacrosse. <laughs> Don't mean to brag, but I'm a world championship dancer, or I'm admired by my fears for my social and political viewpoints and outstanding websites. Let's go with championship dancer, because everybody knows that about me. I know all about the dances. Oh, definitely want to see that. If you're a world champion, I bet you've won some juicy prizes. Yeah, I've won a couple watermelons in my day. <laughs> I can't believe I met such an accomplished person in this stupid bar. You know what, dude? Sweep me off my feet. Like, do whatever you want tonight. All right, let's go to friendlies. Let's go. Next morning, Johnny will take Sarah to the local arcade dance floor stage. <gasps> we did it. You just might crack a fat tonight. The fuck does that mean? This is the massagey. This is the big boy on campus. Wowie, wowie, we have fun tonight. Have you ever felt such a touch before? I know I haven't. Anyway, guys, we now have 21 points, so we have the opportunity to uh, get with some bodacious babes, if you know what I'm saying. But I will leave that for the next episode, so hope that you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought, because I'm, I'm sad that I didn't play more of this sooner, and I had a lot of fun recording this and the last one, so let me know if you want to see more. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to slap that like button right in the face. And I will see you guys in the next video. Love you all. Stay cranky. Bye. What is the one? Crank it,